What's going on, Jerome's? Your Minnesota Fine Vikings have been in transition at the running back position this offseason. As I said, bye-bye to Dalvin Cook. Uh, they re-signed Alexander Madison, and they drafted Dwayne McBride, not to mention uh, King Kenny, as well as Ty Chandler running back. But... Speaking of running backs, they signed one on Thursday uh, in one Abram Smith, the pride of the XFL DC defenders, uh, runners up in the XFL championship this year. So, great. Now, he'll, he'll fit right in. So, uh, a guy who can get to the championship but can't fit it. Great. Fantastic. But uh, let's talk about the new Vikings running back today. A uh, background, he's 24 years young, 5'11", 221. Woo! Got some... Got some power, bowling ball, let's go. Uh, former two-star recruit from Abilene, Texas, and he stayed in Central Texas, uh, went to Baylor, uh, and was basically uh, a one-year wonder. Uh, got, got the job in 2021, 1,601 rushing yards, which is the Bears' uh, single-season rushing record, 6.2 yards per carry, 12 touchdowns, and was just a bully in the Big 12, uh, plus ran for a buck 72 uh, in the Sugar Bowl uh, against Old Miss. Uh, second team, all Big 12. And then the Combine, you know, so the Combine, you know, a 654 RAS for a run back his size is actually pretty good. Uh, his agility, whatever, his uh, explosiveness in it, it drills, whatever, bench, pretty low but 40 at, at 454 at, again at his size a bad also his 10 yard split is elite so that means he's very quick uh, off the ball in a uh, you know, short area which is something that Quasi does stress in all of his prospects and scouting report wise uh, this is from um, nfl.com Lance Zerline uh, round five a projection Ooh, NFL comp, Niall Davis. Ooh, I lo loved him back in the day. Uh, see, that's what dudes will do, <clears throat> where they'll just have a couple of beers, and then they'll just name off old players from fantasy teams. That's it, man. Overview. Big, tough prospect who went from running back to linebacker and then back to running back during his collegiate career. Uh, Smith proved a formidable fit in Baylor's zone scheme uh, with a patient but decisive approach, which is going to be good for the Vikings, and a natural feel for cutback lanes. Uh, he became more comfortable in stretch plays as the season wore on, uh, but his average burst and linear running style uh, makes it easier for linebackers to find him. Uh, he has adequate contact balance and gives good gives as good as he gets uh, as, uh, a run finish, uh, as a run finisher. Uh, Smith's Lack of short area creativity could make him zone dependent. Buddy, you're in luck. Uh, but he's a natural in in that scheme. He has the upside to uh, become a committee back uh, with three down potential. Ultimately ended up going undrafted in 2022. Uh, ended up uh, in camp with the Saints. Uh, ran for 90 yards in preseason. Uh, and then he joined up with the D.C. Defenders of the resurgent XFL. And did pretty damn good. Uh, he was XFL's leading rusher last year with 788 yards. Also had seven uh, touchdowns on the ground. 5.0 uh, yards per carry. Uh, as well as uh, 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 the they played inspiring football in the championship. 90 yards and two touchdowns including uh, busting a long one. But ultimately, uh, the defenders lost to the Arlington Renegades 35-26. Uh, and uh, adding Smith to the running back room. So the Vikings, it's clear that Kwesi was looking for a running back with a little bit more power, whether it be Abram Smith, whether it be Jacques Patrick, who they also had as a tryout, just like larger running backs who can get things done in a short area. And Madison has got some power. He's a really good, well-rounded back. Uh, you know, King Kenny, Ty Chandler, a little bit more speed. Dwayne McBride uh, has size, can run with a little bit of power. But if you're looking for that absolute hammer, Abram Smith could be that guy, plus the fact that he is adept in zone uh, bodes well for him here with the Vikings. Uh, plus, you know, adding Abram, even though the Vikings, I, I think, were solid one through four, uh, Madison getting dinged up in practice, but he did return in full for the night practice on Thursday. It's noteworthy. Uh, and King Kenne has been out for a number of days now uh, with an undisclosed injury, so could be just adding depth in that regard. But uh, I, I do know that Smith was a fa favorite uh, of Saints fans uh, in camp last year. And, of course, he showed well uh, in the XFL, so I'm glad that he's getting another shot here with the Vikings. Uh, and he, he does bring an element that the Vikings you know, maybe were missing in that running back room, just the absolute nail driver, man. Yeah, just pounding in the goal line running back. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, but your thoughts are thoughts of Viking sign XFL star running back Abram Smith. Uh, let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Once we'll worth the work, put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.